Should you upgrade a speaker's crossover? This question comes to us from Jari in Finland. Jari writes, greetings from Finland. I wonder if there is any benefit to replacing stock crossover components to higher quality ones. I have Yamo bookshelf speakers and the crossover seems a bit cheap looking. Well, it's a Yamo. <coughs> I'm sorry. Uh, and I wonder if some easy do-it-yourself component replacements would result in better sound quality coming out, or is it just better to buy more expensive sets of speakers? I can't answer the last one, Yari, because that's kind of up to you. Yamo's, you know, they're, they're giant mass-produced company. I think Yamo is like one of the biggest speaker companies in the world, and they, they throw out, you know, just box after box after box, and, it, and they're good value for the money. They're, they're nothing extraordinary. And crossover components make a huge difference in sound quality, but so too do drivers. <laughs> so from my experience with Yamos, they use decent drivers, but then they sh throw in some real shit components uh, in the crossover. It's about as cheap as it gets. So yeah, I mean, Look, if it were me, I, I'm a do-it-yourself kind of guy. I, I love to futz around with components and parts. And yeah, I, I, you know, look, just make sure that what values you use are pretty close to what they started with. So upgrade the capacitors. Oh, yeah, you could put in some sweet capacitors in there and, and really make a hell of a difference. There's no doubt a coil. For the, for the woofer, to roll off the woofer. Uh, it's probably about as cheap as it can get. You can buy some just beautiful coils for 20 bucks. I mean, not much. So, you know, big, heavy uh, foil if you can. I wouldn't go too crazy because they are Yamos at the end of the day, but within reason, absolutely. And this is another case where we talked a few days earlier I said, wouldn't it be kind of cool if when Paul gives advice, or Chris, or whoever's giving you advice, if, if, if you take that advice and then write me back and say, all right, I took your advice. <laughs> Here's what happened. And I'm coming after you with a hatchet. Um, I, it would just be great to know sometimes how this advice works. But were it me, and I had a, a cheap pair of Yamo speakers or even an expensive pair, and I was itching to make them better, hell yeah. Change the capacitors, change the inductors, and I think you'll be really happy. And, and do let us know if that's what you wind up doing. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Thanks for the great question out there in Finland. And uh, I'll talk to you tomorrow. Okay.